So Mike's just uh, coming over to the tent here and we're going to get things ready to go. Oh boy. Oh boy. Darren. I see, I see Darren, Darren, Darren. Darren, Darren, yeah. Darren, Darren. Uh, you what know, we've got an air show on. No, 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 no. I gotta mow the lawn for the next you, flight. You can't, no. Oh, for the next flight. Well, actually, yeah. I think it's an electric airplane. That's because, not what they said in the program. Because it needs the lawn mode mow today. We're, we're pretty good. It's why, gonna be flying, Why don't you come in here for a minute? Come, 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 come talk to me. No, no, don't let go of the lawn mower. Hang on to the lawn mower. Oh, my gosh. Oh, what's happening here? Oh, we have a flying lawnmower of all things. My gosh, it's nothing Run sacred. Runaway mower. You're seeing the flying Toro lawnmower being flown by our one and only Bob Stovell. And this is a converted lawnmower. It doesn't have your usual engine on board. The Pratt and the uh, Briggs and Stratton motor has been replaced by a definitely a much more powerful uh, Pratt and Whitney engine in there. <laughs> And he has got this thing just going wherever he wants. And he thought it would be a great idea as opposed to having to go out on those cloudy, rainy, cold days to mow the lawn. Why don't I just build a radio control one? So while he started building the radio control, he thought, hey, why don't I make this thing flyable at the same time too? And there you see it's able to do loops. It's able to do rolls at the same time. This thing will do anything. Wouldn't this be a perfect gift for a dad somewhere? Make life so much easier. Be the envy of all of your neighbors. So you've seen the iron flyer you're on, get one of those for the wives and for the men they could get the lawnmower or vice versa you could get the iron for the men and the lawnmower for the wives, depending on what you do. So right now, so you just get to see a beautiful profile on this lawnmower. Bob's going to do a slow pass and fairly low, not too low though, just in case. Going to do a slow flyby, perfect opportunity to take a quick snapshot of this in the sky. Your neighbors and your friends will not believe there's such a thing as a flying lawnmower. This is very tricky to fly because there really is no rudder control on a plane like this. The handles are the rudder. They stick up there, but there's no trailing edges to it, so you can't do too much. Once it's in the air, you're flying it off of the elevons. So the elevator's mixed as ailerons as well. So he's getting ready for his landing approach. It's a little trickier with something like this, especially if there's any crosswind that shows up. So he's coming in on a perfect line approach. Look at this. I think he sees a patch of lawn he'd like to trim a little bit. And a perfect touchdown. How about a big round of applause for Bob Sobel flying the Coral Lawnmower. I think, I think Darren thinks this is going to be it. Um, yes. I think Darren's hoping that the club would go up and buy him a riding lawnmower next time so he could ride with it in the air. 